New information tonight on one of the alleged shooters outside a funeral in Brighton Heights last month. Yes, yeah, Sean Davis was on house arrest with an ankle monitor and video from the district attorney shows him taking that bracelet off about a month before the shooting. Chris Hoffman is live at the Allegheny County Courthouse with what he's learned about this. Chris. Ken, at the time of the shooting, Davis was still under house arrest for a prior incident and said to be wearing the device. Now, in this video, the DA used it in a totally separate case to argue against the use of these electronic monitoring devices. Davis was still under house arrest, and that was set to end around the same time as when this funeral shooting happened. In this new video, alleged funeral shooter Sean Davis is seen waving his ankle monitor bracelet around people in the Allegheny County Jail during a video call. No, you ain't had to cut it. Cut your situation or not? No. Oh, I was about to say. You after? In the two-minute and 13-second video, he shows his ankles without the device several times and talks about how he's been able to take it on and off. Well, I tried to show my dad, bro, and I took it off and I put it back on and, and did all this weird Bro, I took it off yeah. and put it back on. The video is dated September 25th, about a month before the shooting. At this time, Davis was still on electronic home monitoring from a prior incident. He was not set to end his house arrest until around the time of the shooting. The weekend, though, so I, was like, I ain't tripping about my PO coming here right now or nothing. In a statement, the DA's office says the video shows the devices fail to protect the public. Defense attorney Phil DeLacente argues this is just an outlier case. I'm hopeful that this situation does not have a chilling effect, not only uh, uh, upon uh, the judges, but overall with the district attorney's office as well as the defense bar. Davis's attorney had no comment on the video. Now, Davis is still currently in the Allegheny County Jail. He was denied bail after being accused of shooting at that funeral in Bryan Heights last month. Live outside the Allegheny County Courthouse, Chris Hoffman, KDKA News.